The year 2009 brought a lot of change to the CBD streets of Durban, as most of the street names were changed. For instance, roads like Phil Street were changed into Joe's logo. This has caused a lot of controversy as some people feel that the names were not supposed to be changed because they are creating a lot of confusion and they are very hard to pronounce. I don't know who Joe Slovo is and what he has done. I still call the show a fool because I grew up knowing it was coffee. So I can't call it Joe Slovo because it's someone I don't know about. But I did hear that it's the new name of the road because some people call it that way now. But I still call it Field. Maybe if someone asked me what's the name of the road, I told them it's Field because I know it's in that way. It wasn't a good idea to change the name. The right thing that was supposed to be done was to leave it as Field. Joe Slovo who? that feel but whenever I explain to someone I say it's feel true if you have to look at the way the white man had planned this it was all based on who did the actual drawing and planning of the road now when these guys came in mind with politics as you can see the new names Anton Lembeda and Joe's logo that's not helping because for visitors from outside the city if you tell them about Joe's logo they won't know them and the person finally gets lost. And from my view, I think it's wrong. As for example, if I come from the rural areas, I need to know exactly where I'm going. I can't leave home saying I'm going somewhere and actually get there to find that the place name has changed. 